clock has gone off after one hour and 15 minutes, which means my herbs are ready. But when I log on to RuneScape, for some reason, this fart-knocking asshole is telling me it's not. <laughs> Surprise, asshole. I'm longer than 75 minutes. I'm 80 minutes. Fuck this game and fuck you, Mr. Herpy. Oh my god, what's going on today, guys? Alright, so today, Nightmare has uh, finished completing the El Suabador gaming room. Hell yeah, brothers and sisters! Nightmare RH's gaming room is back, fully operational. Woohoo! Uh, in case you uh, people have forgotten, Nightmare has been gone a very long time from his gaming room. So therefore, I had to add some um, stuff to it, such as a computer chair. Or rather, a new computer chair. And also, I kind of built a shelf. Eh, I needed a new shelf, damn it. Don't judge. Sometimes I just need to put more shit somewhere so more shit doesn't go on the fucking ground. Anyways, um, so I've been gone for a very long time, and I was really thinking about what type of video I wanted to start uh, by talking about. And I kind of really just, like, have been in a daze. Because 2019, I was completely gone, came home for a little bit, and then pretty much was gone once again 2020 and uh, also uh, up until uh, two weeks ago. So I really haven't been, like, in RuneScape. What, what I mean by that is my body is just kind of really AFKing RuneScape here and there, but my mind has really not been into RuneScape. I kind of really feel like I have missed all of 2019 updates, all of 2020 updates, and pretty much a lot of 2021 updates. Um, sad but true. The only good thing about it, my fellow cock-knocking, banging people, uh, I had no mold in my fucking basement. When I say basement, it's my gaming room. It's not a fucking dungeon. I'm not whipping fucking Jagex employees down here. Not yet. Uh, finished basement. Um, what you're seeing on the screen right now, that was when I got home in 2019. It was moldy like shit. Oh, that was a fucking nightmare. Luckily, I did not have to deal with that. I just had to build a motherfucking shelf. But anyways, to snap back to reality, uh, I really wanted to go over some of these updates with you people because I feel like a lot of people out there don't even know all the updates that come out on RuneScape. So maybe we should, you know, go over it together so we can learn something. Uh, I'm putting together actually a pretty good streaming slash video uploading schedule for you people. I promise you people at least two new videos per week, maybe three if you guys are spank my ass awesome and lucky. But I will be live streaming definitely um, at least between uh, four to five days every single week. Uh, the times might be a little different, but it, it's good. It's gonna be a while at least a bare minimum of three to four hours per live stream um, I might break it up here and there on some days Maybe do two hours here two hours there, but you people will be very happy and uh, Hopefully you guys, you know want to get spanked in the ass by you know Jagex little employees <laughs> Here we go. All right, so let's see 10 January the Kibos Lowlands. I have no fucking idea what you are, Mr. Lowlands. Uh, aerial fishing. Get Oh, yes. Actually, I do know. So this is basically a farming guild entrance. Uh, ironically, I'm at the farming guild right now. So I actually know what this basically pretty much is. A whole bunch of Zia stuff being added. And a whole bunch of good stuff actually got added. Um, graphical changes and other fixes. Not worrying about that. Boxing mechanics. I actually want to know more about this. Dead Man Boxing Mechanics in the live game. Well, Nightmare RH doesn't do Dead Man because you fucking assholes on Twitch TV hunt me down and make me suck your wiener. It's not a good time. Yeah, so therefore, no. I, I don't give it. It's, it. Will I ever do Dead Man? Maybe. It's just I got to set my Twitch delay on like 10 minutes. And I don't like doing that because then I can't stream like live time and stuff. And it's annoying. Um, Chambers of Exri Exric Zurdic Zurich Zurich. I think I'm pronouncing that correctly. Sorry, but I am name illiterate on this game. Uh, I don't give a fuck about that. X marks a spot. Ooh, are we going on a treasure hunt? 
Uh, free-to-play quests. Fuck that! I've done enough questing on this game. Uh, boss heads, don't care about sixth birthday. Don't really care about a lot of the things, and I actually remember this. Ooh, a message to our community. Let's read that. Old School RuneScape celebrates sixth birthday. Stay safe, and throughout the time we're gone from strength to strength. The release of Old School Mobile has been met. Oh, yes. I actually got to play Old School RuneScape Mobile, actually, while I was in Afghanistan in 2019. Um, okay, so that's actually pretty good. That was actually a good, good update for the mobile device. That's actually pretty damn good. Uh, quest panel, don't really care about that. Message to our community, I just read that. Dead man, don't really care. Uh, treasure trial expansions. Expansion and Easter. Ooh, there's two of them. Let's click on the second one. Um, new little rewards. Beginner, new puzzles. I got a whole bunch of clue scrolls that I actually got to do, but I don't really care about it, like, that much, per se. Um, farming improvements, rebalancing existing content. What in the hell is this? The Seed Vault. Now, this is actually something worth reading about. Nightmare RH is probably... Okay, so it's just basically fucking placeholders. I, I, I thought it was going to give me, like, more EXP. Damn it. Screw you. Zia, some reworks. PvP changes in Deadman. I don't really care about Deadman. Wilderness updates. Changes to Teleblock. Now, this is actually something that Nightmare should know. Clan Wars. Okay, I thought it was something other than Clan Wars. Maybe I'm just getting overexcited. Because I really don't want to get teleblocked in a new little way on this game. That's going to be really annoying. Song of the Elves. Song of the Elves. Below is a summary of the quest line. So, believe it or not, I actually didn't know up until a little over a couple weeks ago that there was actually a new... <laughs> there was actually a priff on Old School RuneScape. That, that's how out of whack that I've been on RuneScape. Because I, I really just didn't know. So eventually, I got to do Song of the Elves so I can actually go to Prif um, on Old School RuneScape. Because like I said, I actually never knew that there was a Prif on Old School RuneScape. Yeah, a friend of mine told me that, and then he laughed at me a very long time. Fuck you, Justin, if you're watching. Uh, let's see, smithing, don't really care about. Bounty Hunter rework, design, and PvP changes. I will be doing a lot of PvP changes. I mean, I will be doing a lot of uh, PvP come near the future. The Granite Mall, I don't really care so much about that. Doesn't really look like anything interesting, to be perfectly honest. Eh, kind of sucks. Kill-death ratios, don't really care about that. Dead Man Standing. For Maki Exiles, don't really care. Halloween 2009 event, I already did that. Mobile Anniversary, fuck yeah, Mobile Anniversary. Twisted Titties, don't really care. And of course, December. 2020 was another fucking blur, too. Eating the bank. What is this? Ah, Twisted Titty Bow. You can now eat food, drink potions. Now, this was actually a really good update, and I actually I really do like this. Yes, I can actually equip stuff in my damn bank. The most annoying thing about Old School RuneScape compared to RuneScape 3 is that you couldn't really equip shit with your bank open. Um, now you actually can, which is actually really good. Old School RuneScape's 7th birthday. So that means Old School RuneScape is 8 years old. Hooray! Uh, considering the fact we're only on 2020. Game improvements, email linking mobile accounts, that's old news. Easter event, old news. I don't really see anything too much that I missed throughout the year of 2020. I mean, I, I wasn't fully gone. I was just living in fucking Germany. Um, uh, eating a lot of uh, damn pasta, pizza. Ooh, bruschetta. Homemade bruschetta. Ooh, yes, sexy. PvP changes. Let's see this. Good morning, thrill seekers. Those who've been paying close attention, now work on updates to various bits of PvP, including Bounty Hunter, Last Man Standing, Revenant Caves. Uh, Bounty Hunter changes today. Implement them. Bounty Hunter to make regarding allow farmers gain a foothold. Okay, this doesn't really have a whole lot of shit. Target worlds. For those who are new to PvP, a uh, player jacker PJ timer prevents on. Yes! Oh, yeah, old school RuneScape. Come on, show me your nipples so I can play with them. Fuck yeah, PJ or timer. Finally. 
I've been ranting and raving about something like this for fucking ever. And they actually added the shit now. Alright, so Nightmare should be a little more safer in the wild. Maybe just a tad. Um, Steam beta announced. I mean, that's that's what I play RuneScape on. I play RuneScape on Steam. Um, just because I like linking my Steam account and how easy it actually is to use Steam. Um, so Steam is actually pretty good uh, for RuneScape, old school RuneScape and RS3. 2021, so uh, yet, yeah, uh, Soul Wars 20th anniversary event. Um, I have actually not done Soul Wars and old school RuneScape just yet. I really should do some with you people on live stream. Um, eighth birthday, hooray, old school RuneScape is eight years old. I can't fucking believe it. Low Ice Mountain. Okay, so this is where a lot of people are kind of really getting a little annoyed. So, they launch fucking clans, which, if you want to join an old school RuneScape clan, uh, Clan Nightmare H is the way to go. Fuck yeah. We have, like, close to 150 hoobas. Um, the thing about it is that they do one update for for the clans and then they basically pretty much stop then they do a clans a guide to the clan system which doesn't really tell you so much a lot of stuff sadly um they need to do like more clan updates they really do theater of blood new modes maybe i'll do that someday i'm not really too sure if i really want to uh combat achievements Theater reworked, and that's basically pretty much about it. And now it's it's all about Dead Man. So that is all the updates that I really missed for three years. Um, to be honest, I am really didn't miss a whole lot except Song of the Elves. I think the biggest thing that I missed on Old School RuneScape was Song of the motherfucking shit titty elf. Ah, yes. And of course, the beloved and hatred RuneScape 3. What, you people thought I was just going to do Old School RuneScape? got to do some of the rs3 probably going to lose some of you little people now but i i really have missed a lot on rs3 and uh I'm, I'm not really going to go ahead and you know go through a lot of this stuff because it is a lot and i i do actually have to read through a lot of this shit um th there's so much on rs3 that i have to really do uh, not to mention, I mean, I, I should be 120 Herblore next double EXP or two double EXP weekends. Uh, I remember when they added 120 farming and then of course, archeology span came out. I was grinding that away for the longest time. Uh, iOS beta as well. Double EXP live this week in RuneScape. Just so much stuff has came out and I, I really have missed a lot of things on RuneScape in the last three years, but I'm, I'm really excited to uh, be back for you people, and hopefully you people are too. Well, I guess me making a video made these things grow a lot quicker, but still, it's kind of bullshit when you have a fucking alarm clock going. Uh, anyways, right now I want to go to my email address and read off some questions uh, from you people. Like I said, uh, expect a lot of content starting uh, next week. Uh, we'll be... I actually may start doing some streaming over this weekend, to be perfectly honest. Yeah, probably, probably most likely will. Surprise, you little ding-dongs. Uh, but otherwise, yeah, I mean, just stay tuned for more stuff. I, I've been busy unpacking, cleaning my house, uh, building some shelves uh, the last, like, week and a half. So I really haven't had a chance to make a video and also stream. But we will uh, be doing some wonderful little things. But otherwise, right now, I want to go to my email address and read off a question from one of you guys. As Yahoo.com, do not drink to me, you who's because if you do, well then, so many updates will happen, you won't even know where to begin with, just like me. First, super hoover question. Hey, Chris, I've watched your videos since 2009. Well over 10 years. God, the time just, woohoo, the time just flies right by, I guess. And it amazes me how I haven't changed much since then. Uh, just a lot less screaming. That's because my throat hurts, my friend. My throat hurts so, so very much. However, who knows? Maybe there will be a lot more screaming in the near future. You should definitely make some more PKing videos. Like I said, I will be making PKing videos, but smashing stuff is a little iffy, especially with ja uh, uh, YouTube demonetizing stuff, which kind of really sucks. It just gets uh, my panties in a knot and brings tears to my face seeing how shit you are at PKing. 
Anyways, keep up the good content. Always thank you for your service. RuneScape username, CLR. That is a very interesting username. Uh, CLR, what can that possibly stand for? Eh, we got to think of something. I'll let you know in my next video what I think CLR actually stands for. I'll, I'll, I'll sleep on it. Um, anyways, I do plan on making new PKing videos. Just like I said, it's going to be rough. Um, I don't want any of my videos to be demonetized. It's annoying and it sucks ass, but we'll find a way to get around it. Um, otherwise, uh, like I said, people, let me know some nasty Duralo comments. Uh, what updates you people have missed and if you are excited for the montaginess of awesomeness to be continued. And I will see you people very soon. Stay tuned for more content. And next week, we're going to be... Uh, exploding out of her ass with new content oh yeah new content everywhere everywhere left and right and especially up your ass out your ass it's going everywhere see you people very soon bye <laughs>